let's dive a little bit deeper and discuss arguments that can be passed to the object methods. Here you can see an example of a very common command in MongoDB shell. Using this command, you can insert new document into existing collection. Of course, this is a subject of another module that we will discuss later, but I just wanted to take this example to demonstrate to you how you can pass arguments to the methods. The goal of this command is to create new document with two key value pairs a equal 10 and b equals true and this document should be created in the collection called test. So this what will be executed when we enter this command. But let's examine this command more deeply. So you already know what is db. So db is an object. Then we access get collection method of this object and we pass a string to this method. So this test is a string that is a single argument that is passed to this get collection method. Then after execution of this method, we execute it because we use this parenthesis with arguments and this method will return us an object that also has its own properties. And then we access insert one method of this new object. This insert one method also requires an argument. And in this case, we pass an object as an argument. So we execute here insert one method because here we see parentheses, but we execute it with an argument. Argument in this case is an object with two key value pairs. And finally, we will get a result. New document will be created in the collection called test. I will not execute this command now because we will talk about documents creation later on in the next modules, but I just wanted to take this command as an example to demonstrate how you can pass arguments to the methods. So this lesson concludes module about MongoDB shell and in the next module we will talk a little bit deeply about MongoDB types, specifically about object ID and about date. See you in the next module.